Uh, we mentioned basketball heavy. I don't see any reason to waste a lot of time. We've got the defending section champs trying to hold on. This year they're the two seed and they're matching up against the top seeded Pirates of Park Center on the girls side. I'm talking of course about the Centennial Cougars. They're the two, Park Center the one. PC features Star Tribune All-Metro area player Adelia McKenzie averaged 31 during the season. Pirates running early, show off with the pass from Lauren Frost. So cold to the D, McKenzie for two. Cougars get a quick trigger three from Hannah Herzig to pull in front early. She had seven on the night. Well-designed play here as McKenzie finds a cutting Frost who does more than pass. Two of her 22 on that score. From the high post to the low post, McKenzie uses the help D to create an and one opportunity. Now more from Frost, who step back, nets her three points, not making it rain, just making it snow. We can go with these puns all night. PC up 38-24 to start the second. We've got a Frost warning for you. Ooh, the three gives you chills. Here's the first look at Jody Anderson. The outside make part of a 24-point night for the junior. Big scoring for her, but her team down big. Cougar defense sucked away from the lane here. Over the top pass to McKenzie. Two more for her. Pirates win convincingly. 68-52. McKenzie and Frost combined for 50 of the 68, and the Pirates are back at state after missing out the last couple of years. Disappointing way for the Cougars season to end. They come in. Second place, so runners up in section five, full ray. Park Center, the champs. This is a centennial team that won the regular season matchup 73-71, but they could not win with the season on the line. We mentioned Anderson with 24, Geyer had 12 in the game. McKenzie, Frost, 28 and 22 respectively. And it is the Pirates who head to the state tournament representing section five, four A.